Build Your Dreams, also known as BYD, is a major player in the global electric vehicle market. They have advanced state-of-the-art in electric vehicles with cutting-edge features, forward-thinking designs, top-tier performance, and most importantly, reasonable prices. However, they are accomplishing something that no other EV manufacturer has, and their output is phenomenal. That's why today, let's take a look at BYD and how they're planning to dominate the entire EV market in years to come. First, we need to examine the company's record in order to predict its future course of action. BYD, which began operations in 1995, is now a global leader in the manufacturing of both rechargeable batteries and electric cars. Initially, BYD focused on creating mobile phone rechargeable batteries, but it has grown to become a major supplier of batteries to mobile phone manufacturers by 2003. Since then, it has branched out into other markets like battery manufacturing, solar energy, retail, and electric automobiles. In 2008, the business launched its first electric vehicle venture by launching the F3DM. The groundbreaking aspect of this automobile was its range, which could go to 87 miles or 140 kilometers on a single charge. Moreover, its peak speed was 120 kilometers per hour or about 75 miles per hour. The more successful BYD E6 would soon replace this model as its successor. The BYD, Kin, and Tang are just a few of the various electric cars the business has launched since then. BYD has emerged as one of the world's leading electric vehicle manufacturers in recent years, with a devoted customer base in both China and Europe. Additionally, the corporation is actively pioneering autonomous driving through extensive research and development efforts. They had the most EVs manufactured in the first half of 2022, and their production of 641,000 new energy cars dwarfs Tesla's global total of 564,000 new electric vehicle sales. Wang Xuanfu, the company's founder, prioritized creating cutting-edge items at reasonable prices by perfecting the manufacturing process. The firm has also mastered the art of utilizing government-issued subsidies and other inducements to expand its product's availability. Using this method, they have risen to the top of the Chinese EV manufacturing list and now have their sights on expanding internationally. They've also made vital alliances with competitors like Volkswagen and Daimler to expand their reach. BYD is poised to become a major participant in the EV market because of the company's exclusive concentration on the sector. The world's largest electric car market is China, but COVID lockdowns, supply chain challenges, and power shortages have slowed BYD's unrelenting progress. From January through March, BYD moved 1,175,321 passenger EVs, and that the total includes both plug-in hybrids and pure electrics. Meanwhile, over that period, Tesla sold 908,573 electric vehicles. So, BYD has made roughly 30% more deliveries compared to Tesla. And for the first time ever, BYD has sold over 230,000 automobiles in a single month. Given that BYD shows no indications of slowing down, it is reasonable to conclude that rival automakers have been placed on notice. By 2023, the Berkshire Hathaway-backed automaker will have set new highs in revenue, profits, and the number of vehicles sold. It has achieved this level of success due to the widespread acclaim enjoyed by its reasonably priced automobiles among China's middle class. It now competes head-on with Tesla for wealthy consumers in the top ranks of the market. Thanks to its two premium brands, we anticipate BYD's expansion into the luxury SUV and sports vehicle industries to begin in 2023. As predicted by Bridget McCarthy, head of China operations for green tech focused US hedge funds Snowball Capital. She also noted that these are the two most expensive vehicle categories. Thus, the expected 2023 increase in profitability should thrill shareholders. One of the two new brands launching at launch is called Yangwang. 
In addition, it will be sold to well-off professionals with promises of superior functionality and cutting-edge features. What makes BYD's promotion of a new brand even more fascinating is the company's assertion that it will be based on highly professional and tailored identities to fulfill the varying needs of consumers. After halting manufacturing of cars powered only by internal combustion engines earlier this year, BYD has firmly established itself as the industry leader, according to Bill Russo, founder and CEO of a Shanghai-based advising business. And now that they've won the race to electrification, he thinks they'll use that success to launch a multi-brand approach. Now, before we continue, I'd like to thank you for getting this far. And if you want to know about BYD's expansion overseas, then make sure to watch this next part. Electric reports that a BID facility in Thailand is being expanded to produce electric vehicles. The facility of the Chinese maker of electric vehicles will open in the Eastern Economic Corridor in Thailand in the year 2024. Furthermore, it can manufacture up to 150,000 zero-emission automobiles every year. Thai industrial developer WHA made a statement after concluding a land acquisition agreement with BYD, which would be used for the factory's construction. The plot of land in question is 96,000 square meters. In Thailand, BYD has chosen Rever Automotive Company as its exclusive distributor. In the first year of the cooperation, it expects to sell over 10,000 electric vehicles in that region. The company's development partner claims that by 2024, BYD will be selling locally manufactured electric cars across Southeast Asia and Europe. By 2024, BYD Thailand plans to manufacture 150,000 electric vehicles yearly at an export facility. Afterward, these automobiles will be distributed around the ASEAN and Europe. BYD has taken another major step with the introduction of sodium-ion batteries. BYD plans to release its smallest EV hatchback with a new sodium-ion battery, departing from previous approaches to the smaller EV market. The BYD Seagull, using groundbreaking sodium-ion chemistry, is scheduled for release in the second quarter of 2023. As the cost of lithium-based NMC batteries continues to rise, having a more cost-effective option is important. In 2023, BYD plans to begin mass manufacturing sodium-ion batteries, allowing the company to release more affordable electric vehicles with a decent range. These batteries are 30% cheaper than their lithium-ion counterparts. Therefore, this action will provide BYD with a competitive advantage. Sodium battery cells have an energy density of 160 watt hours per kilogram, which is why CATL is interested in producing them for use in production cars. But CATL can't do that since they don't make cars. BYD is expected to be the first automaker to provide vehicles powered by sodium ion batteries. At the cheaper end of the market, reduced power density is probably less of an issue. Here, the choice to buy an electric automobile is influenced more by cost than by performance. The study suggests that these batteries may be compatible with the BYD Kin, the Dolphin, and the new Seagull models. Prices for the Kin and Dolphin range from $14,020 to $21,000. Moreover, more than 36% of all battery electric automobiles sold in China this year have been priced at less than $14,000. It will be a major shock for established brands like Mercedes and Volkswagen if they succeed. At least half of these two firms' earnings come from China. Nearly 27 million automobiles are sold annually in China, making up about one-third of the worldwide market. Therefore, BYD will be well on its way to becoming the king of automakers if it can win China. BYD is clearly not satisfied with the Chinese market alone. Now, they've gone above by placing an order for eight cargo ships to transfer their autos worldwide. It has been estimated that these vessels are worth $710 million, and each of the eight ships has a cargo carrying capacity of 7,700 automobiles, which will aid the brand's global expansion. So, is it possible for other automakers to compete with BYD? The future is bright for BYD, 
as the company enjoys rising popularity, more output, new technological advancements, and cheaper costs. However, despite BYD's higher production volume, Tesla has a higher net profit per vehicle sold. As of the end of the third quarter, Tesla has earned $8.87 billion in net income. BYD's net profit for the same time frame was a 9.31 billion yuan, which is equivalent to around $1.14 billion at the current average exchange rate. And compared to BYD's profit of $1,190 per vehicle sold, Tesla's profit of $9,761 is more than eight times as high. Manufacturing automobiles at scale while maintaining a healthy profit margin is no simple feat. And Tesla is helping to wake up the industry to this fact. Ultimately, there are two aspects of Tesla that will never be imitated. They were the first to market with electric cars, giving them a leg up on the competition. They also have Elon Musk, who is a market and industry crossing business magnet on a global scale. He is a cultural figurehead as well as a tremendously smart guy. And it just took a few tweets and his reputation for him to greatly accelerate Tesla's development. In contrast to these other automakers, it's incredible that Tesla spends zero dollars on advertising. It's proof that a great product and a visionary leader like Elon Musk can make a huge difference. So, what are your thoughts about this rising Chinese EV manufacturer? Let me know in the comments section below. And while you're at it, make sure to smash the like and subscribe buttons as well. Now, if you want to know about BYD, then make sure to click and watch this video right here and enjoy. And that's the end of this video guys. See you next time.